If you have a problem, if no one else can help, and if you can find them, maybe you can hire the A-Team. Hi. Hi, guys. Hello. How, How are, are you, Camilla? Fine, you? Had a great day? Yes, I'm a bit tired, but I'm ready to go now. And okay, you? I'm still staying for half an hour, but I'm leaving soon. Half as well. an hour, eh? Yeah. Not more. Maximum. Take, Take care. care. Ciao. Ciao. Bye. Bye. They walk the halls of Parliament in their hundreds. But just what does it take to be an official accredited assistant to one of the 751 MEPs at the European Parliament? I enjoyed this. It's a day-to-day -day learning process. Without all this stuff, you are always out of the game. Consequently, you need a team. And if you have a team, then it must be a good team. We can start with some uh, chocolate for breakfast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Chocolate and so on. And then... Seven years ago. I was 25 years old. Yes. <laughs> I was studying for doing other things in Italy to become a judge. But then I have this opportunity to, to come here, so I'm very happy after seven years to say that was uh, the right choice for me. It's not quite the crack of dawn, but a day for the assistance is early doors to prepare for the day ahead. But first things first. We're going to have an office meeting, but at oh, first really? we can have a coffee if we like wish so. Wow. A coffee. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, we have like uh, four minutes, three minutes. With the three minutes up, meetings continue in the corridors. Jorgi is a 30-something Hungarian assistant who was poached by his MP and brought to Brussels after he stood as a candidate himself in the 2014 EU elections. He deals with the environment and agricultural policy. As a socialist, meet also two members of the European People's Party across various parliamentary committees. Carmela subs for her deputy, the chair of the Environment Committee, who is unable to attend. All the colleagues know well Carmen because uh, she is very active. She is uh, strong when she has to be strong, flexible when she has to be flexible. Standing in for the boss, the job of the assistant needs a jack of all trades. Someone who works fast, writes speeches, researches, organizes meetings, and the list goes on. Italian is my mother tongue, and then English and French. English, German, I'm studying French, and of course I'm speaking Hungarian. To work under stress. So you have to have a bit of multitasking skill. You uh, have to uh, be able to work in a team. Carmela is one of the two accredited assistants based in Brussels for her MEP. In Jorgi's office there are three, so just how many assistants is too much? MEPs can staff their offices at their discretion as long as it falls within parliamentary rules. But I know some MEPs who have only one assistant here. At least 50 or 60 percent uh, added value for an MEP if he has a, or she has a good group behind him. But back to the meetings. For Jorgi, it's a quick coffee to discuss environmental issues. Outside the parliament, it's a working lunch for Carmela. For both assistants, a working lunch is part of a typical day. In theory, the working hours is uh, starting from 9 until uh, last till 6 o'clock. But uh, in practice, we are uh, always available. When the MEP is here, it's rushing all day. Basically, maybe we don't have lunch and then you finish at 10. When the MEP is not here, then you have more time, but then you maybe work more. So do you think you have what it takes to join the A-Team? Applications can be made directly to MEPs. Check their websites for further details.